All right, so I do have a point on this. Uh, I'm going to ask you guys a question, and I fully expect you guys to get it wrong. What is the y-intercept? It is wrong. Zero, negative four, right? So be careful, because on a test, we would want to in indicate that it's zero, negative four, right? But just be careful with that, all right? Zero, negative four is this point. Uh, what's my slope? Well, what's the coefficient of x on this one? One. one. We don't just, we just usually don't show it as one. Now, one as a fraction would be one over one. The reason why we would want to show it as one over one is to show the rise and the run. So if I zoom in on this, I know that my slope is one over one. Both of these are positive. So this positive one means I'd go up one and then to the right one, which would give me this next point. And I can use this uh, kind of like a stair step or a staircase to find all of these other points. You guys see that okay? Well, that's just to the right. The problem is if we want to go to the left, we can make this negative 1 over negative 1. Because negative 1 divided by negative 1 is still positive 1. So in other words, I would go down 1 and to the left 1, which is my next point. Hopefully your graph looks better than this. Or maybe you just continue the staircase down this way. Whatever. It's kind of like Bob Ross, right? You just throw out some stuff and maybe eventually you'll cover with trees. Choice is yours. I like that graph. That's pretty good. Any questions?